Duluth. I left a mess and took my tooth. That'd be too bad. I'd call my dad. Oh dear, that'd be too bad. You'd call your dad. That'd be too bad. Oh, that's... Did you say your father? Fascinating! So what you're saying is, if your lips left you... That'd be too bad, I'd be so sad, I might get mad, I'd call my dad, that'd be too bad. That'd be too bad. That'd be too bad. Why? Cause I love my lips. than I thought. Laddie, what do you see here? Um, that looks like a lip. What about this? It's a lip. And this? It's a lip, it's a lip, it's a lip, 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 it's a lip, it's a lip, it's a lip, 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 it's a lip, it's a lip, it's a lip, 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 lip. Laddie, tell me about your childhood. When I was just two years old, I left my lips out in the cold and they turned blue. What could I do? Oh dear. They turn blue, what could you do? Oh, they turn blue. I see. On the day I got my tooth, I had to kiss my great aunt Ruth. She had a beard, and it felt weird. My, my, she had a beard, and it felt weird? She had a beard. Oh. Ten days after I turned eight, got my lips stuck in a gate. My friends all laughed, and I just stood there until the fire department came and broke the lock with the crowbar, and I had to spend the next six weeks in lip rehab with this kid named Oscar who got stung by a bee right on the and we couldn't even talk to each other until the fifth week because both of our lips were so swollen. And when he did start speaking, he just spoke Polish. And I only know like three words in Polish, except now I know four because Oscar taught me the word for lip. Usta. Your friends all laughed. Usta. How do you spell that? I don't know. So what you're saying is that when you were young... They turned blue, what could I do? She had a beard and it felt weird. My friends all laughed. Usta. I'm confused. I love my lips. Oh, 